do que life paga I comprehend this love you give Tell me where do I begin Where do I begin Oh hey. Look at my hands up Que ma que bicheru bem Ta bicheru the Lord will always be your guide. He will give you plenty to eat even when the ground is dry. It will make your body strong. You will be like a garden that has plenty of water. You will be like a spring of water that never becomes dry. Isaiah 58:11. Hey guys, what's up? Um, welcome to a new vlog. Today is Wednesday. I travel on Sunday. The place of someone that travels doesn't look like she's traveling. <laughs> I've never started back here. Um, I know I said I was going to start a vlog when I'm leaving the country, but this is the beginning of it. I'm going to for a massage. Now, I'm not going for this to them or Ricky or any other place or any other place. I'm going to a local place. So, I'll, I'll just take you there. Like, I won't show you the process because it's really a local place. <laughs> like, the whole process is have to remove. I don't know how to explain it. Do you get? So I'm going for it. I don't know if you are here and you know about the Ijo people, when Ijo people massage you, that kind of thing. So there is no aesthetics. It's just, and I don't think I'll be able to vlog that. So that's why I'm going because that's how I want. I need an Ijo woman to press my body for me before leaving this country. <laughs> so yeah, um, um, I think I just need to wear earring. Should I? And I think from there I'll be going to the so I need to get sleep pass that we should travel because it's not me that'll be wearing um what do you call it? It's not me that'll be wearing sandal or sneakers. I don't have the strength for that. I want ease, like I said earlier. So again, my darlings, welcome to a new vlog. And if you're new, I love you. Thank you for coming back. Please don't forget to like, share, and subscribe. And then if you're old, I love you, you're the OG, and I know you know I always tell you I love you. So yeah, um, I'm out already. Oh, yes, I'm out already. See you at the Joe Man's place. I'll just, I'll take you there, but I don't know how to put it for you people. You know, oh, let me just shut up. See you there. This day that God has given me, I'm not going to waste this joy deep down inside me. I'm not going to shake, been stressed for so long, so stuck in my own way. So I'll enjoy this moment, it's the day that the Lord has made. One thing they don't tell you about relocation is how daunting it is mentally and how daunting it is financially how daunting it is physically in every way it is daunting i thought i was over these emotions and stress earlier in the year even from because uh, when I, I would say it in my um relocation story video that i've not yet done by the way the first sit down video of the year that I said I was going to do. I haven't done it by the way because the when I say when I plan a time for it, something about this location just I'm sounding really pissed because I am. It's stressful. People are always like, Oh, I'm jackpying. I don't think people talk about the stress that comes along with it enough. Anywho, I've done a bit of packing and I believe that I will need another box. So I will need to change the middle box. You know, it comes in a pair of three. So I'll need to change that middle one to, to the big one that is the big size and give my parents the middle one and take a big size so i don't have too many things to go along since they're coming after i've gone i'll leave some of my things with them so that they'll bring when they are coming but the essential things i will need a big box so i don't carry too much even if i have extra luggage it's not too much anyways let me show you what i got from mini so i told you guys i wanted to get slippers so i got this i don't know, is it, it's crocs basically yeah i got it um from them it's oversized but i don't really mind i just don't want to wear anything that is tight i got these key holders i love them um 
<laughs> I've already packed what I wear uh, what I wear what I would used to shower during my layover because I have a very strong depression I will shower I got two face masks two one is vitamin B5 and one I think is vitamin E so I got this two yeah I also got a toner and an S a toner one is this I think okay this is a toner lotion and essence yes toner lotion and essence and then this is the um face cleanser for everything from me so i got tea tree oil that will serve with my deodorant um over there and i've put cream here this is just a a bottle from one of the hotels yeah and then at one of the bars from an hotel so yeah that's what i used to shower and i got power bank because before i travel and even when i'm there just in case for my layover i have my phone powered up in case people need to reach me not in case because people will need to reach me especially my parents uh what else what else is here uh yeah that was it basically i'm done packing till tomorrow i'm tired genuinely tired i just need to sit down and figure out how i will do that first youtube video and my relocation video because i need to do those two before i leave if that's why i'll be even editing on my way i do not mind you get me so yeah i'm going to bed right now or i've closed business for the day to tomorrow ciao hey guys what's up so as you can see i feel packed yeah i'm off to church for the last one present for me before i leave so I'm already late. Somebody's coming to pick me up. I'm late. I've done my hair. I'm sure you guys have seen that. I'll catch up with you guys when I come back. Hey guys, so I'm back from church. I said workers meeting. Yes, if you can hear the fan, ignore it. There's a lot of heat. This is on. It's bad. Um, so I came back from my workers meeting, the unit meeting, the guest unit work for minute meeting, and they gave me a gift. I'm taking this with me. I'm taking it with me. It's a gift. Me and the middle and all the group selfies you had, all the group selfies we've taken. That's what is here. Um, then obviously refreshments. This one, the bottle of Seven Up is what. Let me see if I can take it to show you guys. <laughs> yeah, the bottle of Seven Up. Because that's what I'm using to hold my phone. I've already packed totally. I packed yesterday completely. My dad helped me pack. Um, so right now, all I have to do right now today is shoot my first content that I want to do. If I can do that, I can do the others when I get there and edit the other vlogs so yeah i just want to relax eat relax and shoot that content and keep it moving but yeah oh i'm really leaving today is my last full day in this country <laughs> oof it's a lot it's a lot so yeah let me just shut up let me be going <sighs> last sunday my father's house gown a bag sneakers i see sneakers heels i don't know if you guys can see but yeah you guys i'm leaving say hi to my mommy uh, hi <laughs> i'm leaving she's helping me pack this box i'm carrying these other boxes so bye guys see you at the airport <laughs> So grateful that I'm here to see you. Mommy, please. Did you know I'll show my best friend? Hi, guys. What's up? Um, I'm on my budding gates. Yeah. Um, I don't even know how I'm holding this camera because clearly I can't see. <laughs> I'm on my budding gates. I just left my parents. It's so surreal. Um, <laughs> uh, where do i start okay let me just start from this morning i woke up quite early did a sit down video that i've been talking about how i stay consistent with god i wanted to do two videos about that okay when i come back from church i'm going to do the relocation story video the other two i could do when i get to canada but i now tried doing the relocation story video because it wasn't working but i've loved my parents obviously they blessed me 
when I was leaving church, both the global lead pastor, Pastor Godman, and our resident pastor, PD, they prayed for me. They're like, oh, when I get there, I should let them know. It's just, it's just very sorry about. I can evidently see. <laughs> Wow, maybe when I'm talking about the relocation story, I would say maybe that's even one of the reasons I couldn't even do the video um, at home because I was like, oh, I need to do that video from the house. That was why I started creating content. So I need to do it there, blah, blah, blah. But now I see the reason I'm talking about it. It's just, I don't know, I don't have mixed feelings. Clearly, I miss my parents. Clearly, I miss my church family. I mean, I miss, I miss the unit I work in. Um, I miss everybody, you know, uh, but I'm going, it's a new phase of my life that I need to embrace and I can really see the hand of God in it. Um, it's a lot. Uh, so basically, Sha, I'm, Sha, I'm waiting, my flight is by 10, I think it's currently past 7, so it's 7, 8, 9, 10. I think they said they will start calling us in by 9, um, 9, 9.25, so not really far again. And then, um, after that, I will, I will push out fly. We shall fly to Amsterdam, stop over at Amsterdam. I think I will most likely sleep, or I will shower, shower. Um, and then I will shower. <sighs> um, and then lay over till I get to Canada. And then I will see a friend that I've had for four years that I've never seen physically we just talk on phone and she's in Canada she's actually like my mom's friend's daughter I don't know <laughs> it's not I don't know I know but like you know what I mean I've not seen her but like we're really tight so and I get to see my brother fully after two years of not living together in the same space it's surreal um, I don't know this new phase of my life I've handed it over to God God is the beginning and the end he said the plans he has for me are good enough you know, to give me an expected end actually that is what i'm taking ahead with me so i don't overthink things because i'm an overthinker like you guys know anyways let me shut up and let this battery charge <laughs> i'm talking too much i think it's because i've not spoken to you guys in a while so yeah First leg will be sleep it, pray sleep it because apparently what I'm saying here is we are eating twice on this flight so sleep it, sleep it. Since there's Wi-Fi on board, catch up with my guys that are monitoring me and wanting updates. So yeah. Skincare girl is really proud of me. I'm getting back into skincare slowly. So I've had my bath. And yeah, I've changed. I changed what I was wearing inside. Clearly. It's quite cold here though. I moisturized and did everything. Like I said, my deodorant is the tea tree oil. And then thanks for my perfume oil to help me and help my life in general. Yeah, I'll just let it sit for a while. Before I go outside, I feel like a brand new person.
Go to bed. We are funny. Lounge too. We should be looking for lounge top and down. That's Guys, please, I'm about to eat proper food. It's not proper sha, but proper food. Because I was almost throwing up after I had the food in at the plane. Like I've told you guys, I've showered. I met a new friend. Say hi. Hello. <laughs> Hello. Do you want to? Do you want? Do you want to see your face? I don't mind. See her. <laughs> we're about to. We're about to eat proper proper food. Oh, she's already eating her own. I'm waiting for my because I ordered for a full English breakfast. So yeah, I'm I'm quite hungry. Uh, my flight is in like 40, one hour, but body starts in 45 minutes. So I'll wait. I'm waiting for this the buzzer to go off, go up or go off, and then I will eat. <sighs> we're almost there. We're almost there, guys. It's buzzing already. So yeah, I'm waiting. I think that's my food. Hello, the is the food. <coughs> Let's have a meal, please. I got water instead of coffee. Inform of the water because, bottle. Yeah, <laughs> instead of taking coffee or taking. So, in case they give me rubbish on the plane, I have something in my stomach for eight hours. <laughs> So guys, thank God for my life. That's how I almost missed my flight. We got carried away me and my new friend. We exchanged contacts by the way. She's going to Vancouver, I'm going to Toronto. And like, there is like, um, she has more, I would play over as longer than mine. But me, I'm already on my way, Sha. <sighs> thank God for my life because I almost missed my flight. We were, we were carried away, so I had to run. And I didn't miss it. So yeah, I'm already off to Toronto and yeah, it's really a journey. Grateful, grateful for this journey, man. Grateful for this journey. Look at my hands up. He must keep it cherubim. Tabi Seraphim. Your mercy, your goodness, ni ma fi gara na file. Oh, I see it. Gratitude is it. Oh, and so with everything in me, I say, I show, I show, I show, Jesus. Oh, Jesus. And with everything in me, I say, I show. Every time Thank I look Jesus. Guys, the cold. My hands are literally freezing. Oof. Hey guys, so I'm on my way home from the airport. It's so freaking cold, me like I'm out of the airport. It's freaking cold. I'm on my way to the last place. The lady I told you guys about when I was in Nigeria, where she's my mom's friend daughter yeah angela so yeah it's really cold we're getting gas right now oh this is supposed to be they call it spring <laughs> my dear Melly pontier but we move regardless cheers to angela angela say hi, hi. <laughs> you guys please this vlog is ending now we are taking ice cream we'll continue we'll see more of angela later Hi. Bye. You guys, I need to sleep. This place is cold. Why is your Angela's face? I'm sick. It's not cold. Bye. I show, I show, I show. I show.